everyone, it's Katrina. Welcome to my channel. I have been eagerly anticipating my FabFitFun Summer 2020 box and it finally came a few days ago and I have been waiting patiently to open it so that you can see my reactions to everything that is in here in the raw. Okay, so I literally never ask people to do this because I figure you're gonna subscribe if you want to, but I guess it doesn't hurt to say if you like what you see. A little subscription loyalty never hurt anybody. So I'd super appreciate that, um, but let's dive right in. So this is the box for this summer. I'm liking the colors. Um, definitely tried to match my box on purpose. Yes, not a shame. So um, we've got a cute little woman who looks like she's living her best life in the summer sun. And I can't wait to see what she has in store for me today. Okay, let's open this up. I should do like a, an opening where it's like a treasure box in one of the cartoons and it's all dramatic. Like, hold on, let's, let's try that again. Can I make it glow? Is it glowing? And like, there needs to be like some dramatic music in the back as well. <laughs> All right, ladies and gents, we have none other than Gabby Douglas gracing the front of the magazine for this season. When you get your magazine, I mean, you guys know the drill, I'm sure. It's gonna tell you what your products are, and where they come from and have all these inspirational stories. But my personal favorite is looking at that dollar sign to see how much money I saved, how much money I didn't spend on these amazing products that I've been given. Okay, so the first thing is, oh yes. This little yellow cooler bag, I remember picking this because I just have this idea that I want to be like the girl who picnics, you know what I mean? So this is perfect. It's kind of small, but it's definitely good for two people. Don't try to feed your whole family with this because people are gonna go hungry, but for you and like your cutie, this totally works. Um, I'm happy with it. I love the yellow too. I mean, you can't beat. Okay, <laughs> next. What other good deeds do we have? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Guys, this is a first. This is a first for me. My first beauty blender. This is my first beauty blender because I don't wear foundation. I don't really wear makeup, but lately I've been looking at some brow videos, so. I might want to start there and people have been using these to to get their brows looking good so oh and i couldn't have asked for a nicer color what is this periwinkle indigo i don't care i like it i like it a lot thank you thank you okay oh i remember i picked these guys so the first fabfit fun box that i ever got was from my amazing youth girls they got it for me for my birthday love you girls if you're watching it came with these under eye masks. I love treating myself. To this day, I think it comes with a pack of five. I still have one left from 2018 because I milk them because I want to like make it a very special day when I use them. I like to use them like before going on um, trips like that involve the airport and things like that. So love these and I made sure to pick it. And it also came with a face mask. I wonder if it has a smell. so that didn't open. Okay, I can kind of smell it through there. It's like a nice perfumey smell. Can't wait to use these. Happy with this. Okay, what do I want to pick next? This was another one that I remember picking. The bag. I don't really have a lot of purses because I'm someone who I like, give me a pocket, give me anything. Don't give me a purse because I don't like to carry them around, but you know, I might want to change my ways. This is what the purse looks like. It's got this cute little floral ribbon on it and it's straw. And I really like this for just the beach, I was thinking, or a nice little stroll somewhere. Nice. It's navy blue inside. It's got a nice little pocket, good amount of storage. But I don't know, what do you think? Huh? Huh? 
I think it's time that I stop trying to carry 20 pounds of things in pockets and other sources. I think it's time I join the adult world. Use a purse. Save a pocket, use a purse. You heard it here first, folks. The goodies are still coming, gals. Don't worry. What is this? Oh. Oh. I don't know how you pronounce that dot. I'm assuming it's just like a very modern, off the grid way to use an eye. So I'm gonna say that this is Riddle. Um, roll on fragrance oil. God bless, God bless. It feels like, I just roll. It feels like glass. Oh, please be something yummy. Please be something florally. I'll take citrus, I'll take a musk. Oh yeah. Oh, it's so light. It's like if daisies farted, that would be the smell. Yeah, that's a daisy fart smell. And I'm that is a beautiful thing to behold. I'm not mad. That's nice, fresh. Fresh as a daisy fart. Mm. Next, we still have a few more things. Ooh, I'm gonna save that for last because that looks really cute. Okay, we've got our Turaco foot cream. <sighs> blessed, blessed. Because I was literally sitting in my chair reading this morning and thinking how dry my feet felt. So this is, this is an answer to prayer, an unspoken prayer. Sicilian blood oranges, love blood orange. San Pellegrino blood orange drink, it's my favorite. Mm. Again, it's like nice and light. Remember that scene in Mean Girls where Regina George uses the foot cream on her face? I felt like that right now, like should I just? <laughs> Not minty though. Oh, this is nice. This smells like if an expensive hotel was a smell, it would, it would be this. And next is a beach mist botanical after sun spray. I love the vibe. I love the like shade and kind of palm leaf shadow vibe here. Mm. So I do like to soak up the sun. I do like to get a little gold in this melanin that I have. A beach mist, I've never heard of it. After sun, I wonder if it's like an aloe. Oh, that's nice. Everything smells so good in summery. I'm like, they're fully preparing me for summer. I hope you guys snagged yourself a box. And if you haven't, I don't think it's too late. This says, shake gently before use and spray on the face or desired area of body. So after use, after the sun, it says after sun spray. So yeah, after, after the sun, you spray. Made in the USA. And my final product, guys, I'm not, I, what is the difference? There's like select members and then there's the not select members. I'm one of those, whatever's cheaper, <laughs> that's where I went. So I know that some people get more products but I'm cheap, what can I say? This I'm excited for, cause look how like, hold on, if I can get this bubble wrap out. Okay, okay, okay. What is this? Aloe and tea tree toner. First of all, look how beautiful this packaging is. Just like, get me a dress in this pattern. What? Reveal your most beautiful complexion with the genius formula of our aloe and tea tree toner. I love tea tree, guys. So good for the, uh, the blemishes. Clean beauty ingredients work in sync, work in synchronicity. I know this. Work in synchronicity to soothe and tone skin, correct imperfections, and slow. <laughs> I feel like I'm in like sixth grade all over again. And then like the teacher like yells, it's slaw. Slough, slaw, slough away. Dead skin cells to give you a fresh face and radiant glow. Okay, they've got like a whole book for you to read about what this product does, but I'm gonna go ahead and just dive in here. I mean, this packaging, I see fuchsia. Wow. What are the directions? Don't leave me out here hanging alone. I need to know what to do. This is heavy. This is like a one pound weight. Okay, here we go. I don't smell anything. Am I too peasant of a person to understand what toner is? Does toner just not have a scent? Anti-aging, that's, that's what it's for. I don't know what toner is. 
Let me pick up my magazine here and let's see what this toner is. Reveal your best skin yet as the aloe and tea tree combo soothes skin and there's that word again, y'all. What is, I've never seen this word in my life and I'm someone who like, was never like really ashamed to read, but Salaz. I mean, they really, with the marketing team, I applaud you. Put those words out there that confuse people and make them have to Google so that they know what your product is given to them, okay? It's, it's pretty, but I'm happy I have it. It's heavy and I like it. Guys, oh, that concludes our FabFitFun adventure for now. But do look out for the fall box, highly anticipated. I mean, who does not love the fall? <laughs> not, not me. Thank you so much for watching my video. I do hope that you are having a great time wherever you may be. And I hope that you will see me again in another video very, very soon.